Chen Under of Shenzhen University goes in lane eight for China. He's the first athlete introduced in the Dongan Lake Sports Park Aquatic Center, and he is a very popular contestant, undoubtedly swimming at home. Tommy Lee Kamlong of France, the University of Georgia Bulldog swimmer, just 22, finds himself uh, going in lane one. Qualified with a 3.54.79, but he's a 3.50 swimmer at his best. Jack Hoagland of the United States, the 23-year-old, goes in lane seven. A 3.53 swimmer at his best. He swam 3.54.74 in the preliminaries. Going in lane two, representing uh, Czechia, or Czech Republic, from Charles University in Prague, it's Andre Gemov. A 3.51.65 swimmer at his best. He'll be looking to go below that. Davide Marchello of Italy from the University of Pisa goes in lane six. A 3.48.87 swimmer at his best. He went 3.53 low in the preliminaries. Imotoiki of Japan, the 22-year-old from Chuo University, the 400-meter freestyle champion of the Japanese National Championships. Not an easy competition to win. He went 3.48 at the championships, 3.53 in the preliminaries. The second Italian to go in this field, in this final, is 24-year-old Matteo Lamberti from the University of Brescia, son of the great Giorgio Lamberti, the first Italian world champion. He goes in lane five. Fastest in qualifying, though, was Brazil's Eduardo Oliveira. He pulled away from everyone in the third heat in the morning to lead the field with a 3.50.83, over two seconds clear of anybody else. That puts him in lane four for tonight. So how they line up, Kamlong, Gemov, Imoto, Oliveira, Lamberti, Marcello, Hoagland and Chen. As the swimming competition of Chengdu 2021 gets underway here and now. This can be a punishing event. The 400 meter freestyle, the distance events, 400 meters, 800 meters, 1,500 meter freestyle events require swimmers to be so aware of their position in the race. They need to monitor their fatigue as well. They all have plans undoubtedly set up by themselves and their coaches in consultation. But you don't want to swim the first portion of the race too fast. You don't want to swim too slowly either. It's all about pacing. Long game of Imoto, Oliveira, Lamberti, Marcello, Hoagland, and Chen as the swimmers get onto the starters' blocks. We are underway in the swimming competition of Chengdu 2021. It's the men's 400 meter freestyle final. Quickest reaction time from Gemov going in lane two. Also a really fast start from Imoto Iki, but the underwater very wisely being used by Jack Hoagland of the United States. And he comes out in front as he leads through the 25 meter mark and leads up towards the wall at the first 50. This race so much about not expending yourself in the morning to be able to push yourself in the final. Through the first 50 meters though, it's Chen in lane eight who finds himself uh, touching third, Gemmo from Kamlong are going very nicely as well in uh, this race. Uh, 27 odd through the first uh, few 50 meters for these athletes as they come back now through coming up towards the 100 meter mark. The American Hoagland is looking very comfortable, the 23 year old going in lane seven, so too going in. Uh, Lane two, game off, a 55-32 at the wall for the Czech swimmer, ahead of the two Italians, Lamberti and Marchello, who've paced themselves nicely, it seems, and they've found their rhythm. A reminder that Oliveira really pulled away from everyone in the third heat in the morning. He knows how to swim this. He pushed himself. He went 155-42 over the first 200, then came home with the fastest splits. He split 155-41 on the back 200. At the 150, it is Lamberti who touches ahead of Gemov. Imoto now is coming into his race. So important as well to watch the legs for the swimmers. They will increase the beat rate, some of these swimmers, over the course of this race. 
Some will be looking at uh, two beats, some will be looking at four beats, some will be even looking at six beats in the earlier stages of the race, but arguably all will be looking at six beats as they come up towards the 200-meter uh, mark. And in the finishing stages, they will look for that. It's Lamberti in lane five, who is pulled half a body length clear of Oliveira alongside him in four. Gemov is still very much in this race. Imorto has dropped back ever so slightly. Well, Matteo Lamberti is looking solid, leading at the 150 and leading at the 200. There's a little bit of a push now from Gemov to get himself back into contention, just breathing to uh, his right. Every second stroke is uh, Gemov, so he won't be able to see what is happening going the way that he's just been going in the pool. Lamberti, Oliveira and Imoto. As Gemov drops back a little, the Charles University in Prague swimmer, it's Lamberti who continues to lead. He is a 3.46 swimmer at his best. He is the fastest in the field. He knows what he needs to do in the pool. He is the son of the great Giorgio Lamberti, the first Italian world champion, a former world record holder in freestyle events. But he is going to be challenged undoubtedly by Oliveira, who's very good at the turns. And turns can separate the very best swimmers. Oliveira now within uh, point two effectively in the second of Lamberti who is leading and looking to push the pace now while Lamberti touched at the wall it is neck and neck between Oliveira and Lamberti. Lamberti will have his plan. The plan will uh, be exposed over the last 100 meters coming up towards the 350 meter mark though. Lamberti and Oliveira alongside one another they turn almost identically six hundredths of a second separating the two Brazil and Italy who's it going to be Imoto is still in this race but he's effectively down by a second it's lanes five and four coming back Lamberti potentially has the greatest speed in the water but Oliveira seems buoyed by his early morning success it looks to be Lamberti though with 25 meters to go who is leading this race Italy have great representation in this race with Marcello and Lamberti it's going to be Lamberti for Italy who will get the wall first. Oliveira finds himself finishing second with Imoto third. And we have our first gold medal in the pool at Chengdu 2021. Lamberti of Italy with the gold. The man from the University of Brescia. What a quality race. He was pushed by Oliveira alongside him. And a great touch from Oliveira to go sub 350 as he went 349 for a new personal best, but Matteo Lamberti, 3.46 at his best, not quite his best, but he paced his race well. Great reaction time off the blocks from Gemov and Imoto of Japan going in lane three. But Lamberti hit the front at the 150 meter mark and really did not look back. While he was challenged at the 350 mark by uh, Eduardo Oliveira of Brazil, it was Lamberti who was able to glide to the wall. Such was the extent of his advantage in the pool. Caught slightly between strokes, took the risk, and out-touched Oliveira of Brazil. It's Lamberti over Oliveira over Imoto. Gemov just outside the medals, and Davide Marquello with a very good fifth.